don't miss any content don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell Welcome back to the channel so today we're going to talk about two Ghanaian players Abdo Babaraman one of them and also Richmond Boache Yadom Abdo Babaraman and not a great time for him he's still with Chelsea and is set to make another loan move yeah this guy has gone on loan so many times to other teams never getting a permanent move and this is what most of the time the Chelsea loan system does to you he has not had an injury free career so far uh, he was called up into the black stars team amidst a lot of talk as to why he was called someone who's not getting regular playing time under 23 he has it been playing with at chelsea now he's set for a move to where greece more details coming up today also Ghanaian player richmond boachi adam has written off unpaid wages and has decided not to report his club side which he recently left Restar Belgrade to FIFA for unpaid uh, salaries. We'll be looking at why he has done that. Subscribe if you haven't and click on the notification bell to get more updates. So Ghanaian player Abdo Baba Ramana. Not a really really easy time for him now. The Ghanaian was back from loan stint at RCD Mallorca. Came back to Chelsea and was not included in Chelsea's 26-man squad for the Premier League season by Frank Lampard. Lampard has left the Blues and Abdul Barbaraman is still languishing with the under-23s. He was caught up recently to the Ghana Black Stars and missed a lot of talk as to why someone who cannot even get into the Chelsea bench or Chelsea reserves is being allowed uh, to play for the Ghana Black Stars. He impressed, however, not in both games, but it was clear that Abdul Babaraman is a player who needs an opportunity, who needs a chance to be taken on him. In his early stages, he showed so much promise. So Abdul Babaraman has not had the best of time uh, for uh, the Blues, and now he is set for another loan move. After his loan stint with Schalke Zero Capital, he went uh, to in France uh, to class Stade de Riem and also to RCD Mallorca where he suffered another injury setback. He is now set to join a Greek side. Yes, you heard me right. Now the Ghana defender and left back is close to joining Greek club PAOK Saloniki on loan from Chelsea. Now the fullback is bound to a fullback is bound to a 6 month loan move to the Greek side to try and get his career back on track having spent six months with the Blues under 23 team. Now the 26 year old arrived at Chelsea in August 2015 from German Bundesliga side Augsburg for free of around for a fee of around 26 million euros but has found his chances limited coupled with a series of injuries. This wound up to other loan spells Schalke, Stade Reim, Mallorca that he has had in the past. Quite unfortunate news there. We hope his career does get off to the start that he is looking for because this is a guy who showed so much promise, especially in the AFCON 2015. It was a great AFCON for him, but unfortunate that he did not or he was not able to get into it. And a great AFCON for him that showed so much promise for the future. But it was quite unfortunate that things didn't go right for him and moving forward in his career and he had to go through a lot of loan spells and up and down. It has not been easy for the guy and uh, we hope that he does get some time to play and enjoy his football here uh, with uh, this week side. A six month loan deal after spending six months with Chelsea under 23. We wish Barbara Man all the very very best. My final story has to do with Richmond Boache Adam. He has left Red Star Belgrade and Red Star Belgrade were owing him some monies. Yeah, they were owing him monies, unpaid salaries and he has decided to write it off. He says he will not report Red Star Belgrade to FIFA. And now the Ghana Ford, out of good gesture, has decided not to report Red Star Belgrade to FIFA of unpaid wages and bonuses amounting to 250,000 euros. Now the 27 year old left the club in December uh, with monies owed him for more than 6 months. Wow. Uh, with the coronavirus pandemic hitting the finances of the club, the Ghana International has told the club to write off the debt. The former Juventus striker confirmed this in an interview. Yes, it is true. 
I left the money with them. Resta is my home and this is also a time to give back to the club. After the opportunity they gave me, I am very grateful. Wachi Adam left the Serbian Giants after the expiration of his contract in December last year. He enters into the history books of the club as the third foreign player with the most goals. Wachi popularly called Boko scored 60 goals in over 100 games for the White and Red Army. He won two Serbian Premier League titles in his four year stint with the club. Wachi Adam is currently a free agent uh, with clubs from Europe showing interest in him before. Great, great gesture from him. In these tough times, we need more people like this who will be benevolent enough. He has written off the debt or he has written off the salaries owed him because the COVID-19 pandemic as it is still ravaging across the world, don't forget to max up, has hit the finances of the Serbian club really hard. And it seems that paying him his salary or paying him a salary arrears will not be easy for the club and it, it's 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 something that uh, he has thought through something that he thinks he has to do to give back to the club who has given him an opportunity to play for them and to showcase his talent to the world and i couldn't be any prouder that he is a Ghanaian and he is doing this amazing thing for his club side red star Upgrade. So that has been it for today. Talking about Guardian player Richwan Bwachiyaro's amazing gesture uh, to his club side Red Star Belgrade, he, which he left after his contract expired in December. Also, Barbara Mann. Barbara Mann is still looking for a club, and now he has been he set for a loan move uh, for Greek side PAOK Thessaloniki. Wish him all the very best. I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know your thoughts in the comments box on the stories. Enjoy your day.